If you've been hearing a lot about semiconductor company NVIDIA, NASDAQ, NVDA, in recent months and you're not sure why, check out its returns in recent years. See? NVIDIA's performance has been phenomenal, and unsurprisingly, lots of people are kicking themselves, wishing they'd bought into the stock long ago. You may be one of those people, and if you are, take heart. There's a decent chance you've been invested in NVIDIA all along. Before we begin, this video is not an investment advice and must do your own diligence. However, with my experience investing for years, the content from this video has a solid research foundation. Check our patron on the description below for an inside members-only access on what are the best buys now. We will also update you on what to sell for gains or to avoid losses. Subscribe to our channel so you will never miss out. Surprise, you may own NVIDIA. So, how could you be an investor in NVIDIA without even realizing it? Well, if you own shares of an S&P 500 index fund, such as the Vanguard S&P 500 ETF, the SPDR S&P 500 ETF, or the Vanguard 500 Index Investor, you're a small co-owner of NVIDIA. Note that ETFs are exchange-traded funds, mutual fund-like securities that trade like stocks. Remember that S&P 500 Index Funds aim to hold the same stocks in the S&P 500 Index in the same proportions, thereby achieving pretty much the same returns less fees, which tend to be minuscule. The SPDR S&P 500 ETF, for example, recently sported these top holdings. If you don't own NVIDIA. But what if you're not an NVIDIA shareholder? Are you out of luck? Not necessarily. You could still buy shares of the stock, but know that it carries a fairly steep valuation, and in some eyes, it's priced for perfection. Meaning that if it slips or disappoints, its stock could be punished. This can be less of an issue if you plan to hold your shares for many years. So do some research before buying, and if you're on the fence about it, perhaps just add the stock to your watch list or buy into it incrementally over time. Alternatively, you might invest in one or more ETFs that include NVIDIA among their holdings, though even ETFs can decline in value if their holdings do. One way or another, you can be an NVIDIA shareholder sharing in the company's long-term success or disappointments. Give us a like if you like our video, subscribe and ring the bell to never miss out. Check our patron for an inside look on what are the best buy and sell stocks every week.